All right, Jonathan, this is the, uh, the Gen 2 F35 helmet mounted display system. So I'll have you put this on and then you'll see uh, a little bit of how the, uh, the advanced capability in this helmet really helps the pilots. So, lift the so this is what there. all the pilots on the F-35 will be yes, wearing? Yes, sir. This is what all the pilots are wearing today. Wow. What am I seeing? The so green... what you're seeing in there is the, uh, the data, is the aircraft, uh, what used to be called the heads-up display. So the pilot's flying data, his altitude, his airspeed, his direction, flight vector, any other information is on there. So that's all now inside the visor. The other thing you're seeing is the, the night image or the infrared image from the distributed aperture system cameras that are around the aircraft. Uh, it was originally designed as a missile warning system, but uh, what our engineers found is they could also take that infrared picture, put that in the inside of the visor, so now the pilots use that for their night vision capability instead of having to wear a separate set of night vision goggles. So they flip a switch, it puts that uh, 40 degree wide, 30 degree high scene up inside the helmet, and as you're seeing, as you move your head, the helmet is tracked by the airplane, so the F-35 knows where the pilot's looking, and it puts the correct scene up in front of you. So now you're looking down and uh, actually looking through the bottom of the aircraft using the cameras that are on the bottom to see what's below you. So this is looking through the airplane. I'm seeing what's underneath me, which wouldn't have been possible before. No, you would have had to, uh, to rock a wing up and look out the side of the airplane, but now since there's cameras all around the airplane, you can look 360 degrees, Turn around your seat, look behind you. That's an expensive helmet there, $400,000. About 250,000 uh, pounds, I think, is uh, About, the I equivalent guess. British. Uh, when I was flying before, we'd have four or five different displays, and we'd have to do the interpretation uh, in our minds while we're flying at 500 knots. Here, the airplane takes a sensor integration, puts all that data together, and presents that as information to the pilot. And that's what you're seeing in the visor and also in the cockpit. So, so it allows them to see the, uh, the battle space, see where the, uh, the good guys and the bad guys are, see where the threats are, and uh, successfully prosecute their mission.